I think it's when my parents brought me to a museum in France, the Museum of the Louvre in Paris, and I saw some painting. I was something like five years old, and I saw some painting from great masters that were incredible. The, the people, the portrait looked so realistic, I was shocked. So, and since this time, I'm painting and painting and trying to reach the same level than the masters I saw in the past. The, I'm a painter and I, per, I, I paint in hyper-realistic style and everything is illusion. So I love to create the illusion of three dimension with something two dimensional and it's, I love that. And everything is illusion, the way we the perception of the world around us, it's just an illusion. Our brain creates a, a, a picture, uh, like a camera, like the camera you use now, with pixels and the brain builds something, so your brain is able to understand what you see, but sometimes it's fake, and you can reproduce something and create the same illusion with something flat. I love to change my subject, and the beauty is everywhere, so I paint everything, portraits, landscapes, and. Uh, I, don't, I hate to do the same thing every day. I don't understand people that paint flowers every day or paint, it's boring. So, and the inspiration is usually in the light because the illusion is created by the light and the shadows. So when there is a beautiful light like today here, I like to paint. I think we need more and more hearts and it's great to have these kind of events because even in school, there is no more heart. It's replaced by technology, mathematics, and it's horrible. And it's not fun, no romanticism anymore. And we need hearts, and it's a good way to promote hearts.